it's been five years since this photograph, fantastic picture, of Stephen Sutton went viral. The 19-year-old who was suffering from cancer posted it just weeks before he died. And in his final months, Stephen raised millions of pounds for Teenage Cancer Trust, completing loads of challenges on his bucket list. And since then, well, his mum, Jane, she's continued fundraising in his name and joins me now. It's so good to see you, Jane. Can't believe it's been five years since you lost your son. No, that's right, it has. It's just gone by so quickly and everybody, you know, just still continues to fundraise in Stephen's name and they just rem they remember his name, they remember the iconic thumbs up. We all remember that photo, Jane. It, it really has impacted so hugely on, on everyone and it got people thinking, talking, fundraising. You know, he did so, so much. It certainly did. I say the impact of that, like the picture, obviously there's a fundraising around it. I mean, what that did for Teenage Cancer Trust was bring them closer to their goal of re reaching every young person uh, with cancer. I mean, the money, three million pounds when Stephen incredible. passed away, it's just an incredible amount. And still, you, you still, the fundraising goes on. I mean, five years down the lane, it hasn't stopped, has it? That's right, no, it hasn't. <laughs> no, it's five, it's currently 5.7 million pounds, wow. which is just an astonishing amount. And it's just, you know, the things that that money is enabling Teenage Cancer Trust to do. Mm. So it's, you so know, it can I mean, help loads of teenagers. That's right, it can. I mean, Stephen's legacy is helping like people now, young people now, and it will continue to do so in the future. I mean, obviously, losing him is a, is a nightmare. You know, I guess you must have had time to come to terms with that, although he was so positive, wasn't he? Right up until the end, he was really positive. I think that's the thing with Stephen, yes, he was. So I suppose in what you know, people would describe really as his darkest moments, he was, all he wanted to do he was just still posi so positive, yeah. uh, he was still so motivated, and all he wanted to do was just continue in raising money to help others. You must be, continue to be proud of him. I am, I'm just so, so proud. proud, yes, really am. And the kind of outpouring, because so many people, you know, not just people in the public eye, but so many people got behind this campaign and obviously must have got in touch with you after his death. Did that help you? Because I, I don't, I'm not sure whether it does, because I've not been in that position, you know, to get that sort of recognition for your boy? Oh, it was, it's just been amazing, it really has. Um, in the same way that the outpouring of love that was there for Stephen, that helped keep him, like, incredibly yeah. strong and kept him motivated. I like to think, in a way, that he's now left me just surrounded by all, like, you know, that same positive yeah, energy yeah, and that yeah. love, because oh. I do, I just get some lovely messages. It's great. From people that I don't know, and that's from people, like, you know, in the UK mm. and around the world. Oh, because it went global. It, it certainly did. did. Yeah, it now, certainly look, did. I don't know what Stephen would have thought of this. He probably would have been right behind you saying, go for it, Mum, but you're doing a zip wire challenge. <laughs> that's right, we are, on the 7th of September, <laughs> yes, in North Wales. And this is all about getting um, Stephen's fundraising total over the right. £6 million yeah, pounds this year easy, on the 5th anniversary. Yeah, so it's the world's fastest, Europe's longest zip wire. And we're <gasps> just hoping to get as many one. people involved as we can. <laughs> it's fantastic. You are brave. I mean, you've done loads of challenges. We saw you did Kilimanjaro. You've been doing all of these things in, in your boy's name, in his name, of course. Um, do you always feel he's there? Do you feel he's there? Like, when you're doing the zip wire and you're doing all these things, maybe you're just thinking to yourself, I'm not sure about this. I don't think I ever think I'm, I'm not sure about it. It's just always for me, it's just always, remember Stephen's words, which yeah. was like, you know, just push yourself outside like your comfort zone, just continually take on new challenges and just make the most of every minute, really. Just oh, take fantastic. up every opportunity fantastic. that you can. Where did that come from? And Stephen, do you think, was it, was it you? Was it, was it just that that's the way he was? You know, that, just that, because that's remarkable to be so positive and so driven and so determined to make a difference. I think it was just Stephen, Stephen's personality. Whatever he put his mind to, whether it be like his, his schoolwork, uh, he was a keen sportsman as well, and he was just always like incredibly like driven and motivated, and he always gave everything like, you know, he always did his best at everything. Um, and that continued really with the fundraising. I mean, Stephen wanted to be a GP, he wanted to make a difference. Um, and although his, his, his cancer diagnosis um, meant that that wasn't possible, I still like to think that he did achieve that core purpose yeah. because he did make a difference and he's still managing to, to help people. Oh, it's remarkable. An absolutely remarkable young man. And you're continuing bearing the torch. You I know, it continues am, to yes, go and yes. you'll be on that zip wire. Yes. And you want as many people as possible to help, to join in, to 
artists contribute to do what they can? Yes, we do, yeah, because what we've done, we've negotiated a special rate um, with Zip World, and then we're just asking people if they can raise a minimum <laughs> of £120. They can go in it. And it's, it's just all about following <laughs> Stephen's mantra, really, love which it. was there should be fun in fundraising. Oh, I love that as well. Fun and in fundraising. fundraising. Yes. What an amazing young man. Thank you very much. Thank you Thank so you. much, Jean. Thank you. To see you. Thank you.